Hey guys, Nui here. Uh, I just downloaded Path of Exile, which is a game that is new to me, but from what I've heard, it's somewhat like Diablo. Uh, so I've been interested to look at it. From what I've heard also, it has a huge talent tree of like 1,400 talents or something, so I'm very interested to see what that's going to be like. Uh, today, this video is really just going to be me going through creating my first character and getting a first look at the world. Um, if from what I've heard from my friend, uh, which is CB and Brian, who also do like uh, League of Legends and Pokemon, Pokemon Mobile videos with me, uh, it's been pretty cool looking. So I'm interested to get into it, and uh, I will probably be doing a series of just like playing through this game with them. Uh, we'll probably get a bunch of videos done for that, and most likely, uh, I'm just gonna have a ton of fun in this game. Um, what I'm, at least that's what I'm hoping. Um, I typically, when it comes to games like this, I typically go for range classes, and, but I also intend to know, or tend to go into classes that can really get inside the fight and, uh, do a lot of damage really fast, so, look, I'll be definitely looking into each and every class. Uh, I'm just gonna finish up doing a couple options here, uh, like, just basic UI options, because when you first log into this game, the music is really, really loud. So I'm just trying to bring everything down to my standard, and then uh, I'll be getting into how I want to do this. Um, alright, I think that's good, uh, so, just create, create my first character here, wait, 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 get the standard, hardcore, SSF hardcore, uh, say standard, I guess, yeah, I'll just go show all, um, uh, I'm create my first character here, so, what do we have? I fought, wept, and bled for God and the Order. I would have died for my Templar brothers, every single one. And how do they reward my piety, my devotion? They exile me to the land of the damned, to Rayclast. I know now that my brethren are merely God's tools. He has given me this path to walk, so I shall muster my strength and my power. And my faith. It is my shield against the darkness to come. Um. Okay, so that's interesting. Uh. It's very odd, for me at least, to hear a game that tells you, has the characters themselves actually tell you the whole storyline instead of just having you read it, but that's interesting. Uh, so we have the Templar class, the Shadow class. A simple job, I was told. The Marauder. I am a warrior. The ranger. No life can be owned. A duelist. He had it coming. And a witch. Was I supposed to? They were right to fear uh, me. If only they had listened to their cowardice. Had they not taken my home with fire, I would not have taken their children. Oh, shit. Now I'm banished to Rayclast. Fuck? I've heard the dark rumors, seen the terror in the other exile's eyes. But to me, one land is like any other. The elements are my allies, the dead are my servants. And fear will be my closest friend. Fuck that class. Oh my god. That, Jesus. A simple job I was Stealing told. children is Silence Jesus. a big mouth, get a big payout. And no one was going to be the wiser. Tidy. Except for one loose end. Me. I would have kept my mouth shut. Professional integrity, it's called. Unfortunately, not something my employers believed in. They raised a toast to a job well done. I drank, and the next thing I know, I'm on this stinking crate bound for exile. It's not a complete loss, I suppose. The way I hear it, there'll be plenty of work for a man of my talents in Rayclast. Yeah, I'm just gonna go with this. Um, I like the kind of thief class, the kind of uh, uh, assassinish class, I should say. So this kind of fits my my likings. Okay, 
right? So I started washed up on the floor. All right. So how how? Oh, that's actually pretty detailed. Uh, yeah. Get yeah. The, get the Nothing like a brisk dip to start the day. Now where on God's ass am I? Okay, so this is interesting. Uh, how do I, can I rotate the camera? I can't rotate the camera or anything. Um, maybe I should have, maybe I should have read that. Uh, a glass shank stagnant, okay. Oh, then, oh, hold oh, on, my bad, I did not mean to do that. Uh, what do we see Bastards dump near two dozen of us off that ship. Uh, you and me were all that survived the swim. <laughs> Never was much difference between exile and the death sentence. <laughs> uh, once I catch my breath here, we'll take a look around, see what Ray Class does on offer. We thought I saw smoke at those ruins up the beach. It could be worth checking if there's. Oh shit! Oh my god! Oh, that just... This motherfucker just ate you. Okay, I can just click the. Is it possible to murder someone who's already dead? Uh, I'm, I mean, I'm pretty sure it is. You just killed someone. What is this now? Attack duration, melee, chaos. Um, level 1, 5 mana cost, cross level 1. Hits the enemy, adding some of your physical damage as chaos damage, implying poison. Applies a claw, dagger, or sword. 25 of physical damage converted to chaos damage. Base duration is 8 seconds, deals 130% of base damage, always poison on hit. Okay, so you can socket abilities into the weapon so that the weapon will, itself will have it, not the actual ability yourself. That's interesting. Right. Where is it? Where is it equipped? Oh, it's just a, it's a passive, I guess? What else do I have here? Identify manual. Okay, that's interesting. Um, yeah, this is the massive skill tree I was talking about before. Uh, as you can see, it's just huge. It scrolls all all of actually. I can yeah, I can scroll out for you guys and see what that looks like. Yeah, just any type of thing you you could want to think of. Um, I'm probably gonna be. Uh, I'm not really sure where I'm gonna go with this yet, but, uh, I assume since I'm a, 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 a more of an assassin class, I'll probably be scaling down towards, the, like, stuff like this, where I get, like, dexterity and all that stuff, because I feel like that's just better for me overall, but I'm not sure if everyone has to, I, I'm not sure if this is the start. Like, I'm not sure where to start with this. Can I just start anywhere, or do I start here, because this is where... Like, I feel like if you're on a different class, then these might open up. And I'll probably check that. Um, but I feel like, yeah, this is where I have to start. And then these are, this is like my main branch of stuff, but I can still kind of, if I just kind of want to veer off, I guess, I can still end up over here, I guess and over here, but I don't know if I will easily be able to end up over here. But, we're definitely going to be looking into that. Um, that seems interesting. Oh, there's actually achievements and stuff in here? Uh, there's quite a few achievements, actually. Okay. It's a, oh, there's a ton of achievements. This is cool. There's a ton of challenges. Okay. That'll be fun. Um... My social screen light. Oh, I think this is where I can add friends, create a party. Okay, so I don't have to do this all alone. Oh, it's Act 1. Okay. Bunch of levels and stuff. Um, I have my map, but this map's not great. Uh, not options, but. Oh, this is the same option screen. Okay, that's pretty good. Um, Q to be your key. That's, I think that's fine, yeah. Alright, I should be fine. Uh, I'm not sure which way I'm supposed to be going here. Is there anything else I can scavenge off this beach? Or, that's actually annoying. I might have to go to full screen mode because 
Um, I keep accidentally clicking out of the uh, box. Just shift. You can hold shift to attack with that one. Why would I? Why would I want to attack with that one? Why can't you? Yeah, I can dodge. So why would I want to attack with that movie? That's a weird. That seems. Oh shit. Also, oh, it is very possible to die. I guess in this tutorial. Um, tab. Monster level one. Oh, that's cool. Okay, that's interesting. Oh, and it makes it, it makes it fuller, so I can see. Okay, that's cool. Uh, it's not great. Uh, okay, health potions do quite a bit of health. That's pretty good. Kill that. Kill that. That's a lot of zombies. Is there any way I can break these guys off into like groups of one? Oh. Got him. Okay, that's two. Okay. Uh, still not really sure where to go. Like the environment is very explorable. Um, it's pretty pretty to me. Like it definitely is definitely giving me that Diablo vibe. So I'm pretty excited on what these are. What the fuck? Oh, These things are creepy. Uh, it's that yeah, but it's definitely giving me that Diablo vibe. So this should be interesting. Um, this is just a big wall, I guess. Okay, I don't have to let them hit me. I think. So I'll just keep traveling this way. Uh, I think this is where they said to go. And I mean, typically in games like this, you see monsters, you're probably going to die. Oh, he dropped something, I think. Hmm. Okay. Oh, there's a ton of monsters that way. I'm not sure if I'm getting XP or not, so... Like, I'm not sure if there's anywhere to check where I'm get if I'm getting XP, or... Oh, oh, there's my, oh, there's my XP bar right there. I didn't even realize that, wow. My bad, guys. Um... am I getting though? 328 current so I'm getting how much? 328 uh, so 8 XP per person? I guess I have unlimited potions or whatever for whatever reason here so they don't really want you to die here. <laughs> I guess. Okay, so I have I'm almost a level two. So let's try to get to level two here. Uh, that's the chat bar. If you guys are wondering, I just came up. UI, UI is pretty, pretty responsive. Uh, the map is pretty, is pretty interesting. It's pretty. Uh, well detailed. Uh, I can zoom in on my character pretty well. I'm not really liking the outfit he's wearing. I assume uh, once you get some more items, that that will definitely change. But uh, oh, what the fuck is that? Okay, I guess that's the thing. Wait, did he pick the sword? Was he holding that sword the whole time? Because I don't think he was. Because if that... If he definitely wasn't... No, he definitely wasn't holding that. So what I'm thinking is that... Uh, the boss tactics change based on their lower health. 
which is good because it makes things more challenging instead of just doing the same kind of mechanics over and over again. I have to actually learn his patterns a little bit. Uh, which, oh, that's that's cool. That's okay. I don't know what the fuck this thing is. Oh, I can't. It's nice there. not being dead yet. You gained a skill point. Uh, each town. Oh, so I just have to get over to town. Okay. So I'm gonna do that, and then I'm gonna probably wrap up this episode and just, uh, wait and see what everybody else is doing, and we'll all get together and play this game. Um, so let's see. Oh, yeah. I got a skill point. Yeah, so that, like I thought, this was the starting point, so I can either go into elemental damage and energy shield, or physical damage, physical and chaos damage and life. Uh, most likely I'll be going into that. That just sounds better. Um, I mean, shielding is great, I guess. Like, I don't, I don't mind using shielding, but I probably, I'm more prone to making classes that like have high dodge chance and high damage, and then kind of higher uh, crits and stuff like that, than just making things that are tanky. At least on terms of classes that I don't really consider it a tank. Oh, did I get items here? There's items here. Okay. Need a club. Is there anything else? Uh, jeez, what's that? That is a weird body. Okay, so, um, what was it, I? Yeah, it's I. Eyes in inventory, a twig spirit shield, requires 15 intelligence, portal skull, what is this now? Creates a portal to town, so I might need to use that right now, and then there's a sword, I can use the sword and stuff, and then I can use the portal, but I can't use this stuff. Where can I see my stats? That's one thing I do want to check. I can check my character screen, maybe? Yeah, here's where I can see my stats. Um, so apparently I have a name. Intelligence, dexterity, strength. Two strength equals one life. Five strength equals one percent physical melee damage okay uh two intelligence equals one mana five intelligence equals one percent energy shield okay and one dexterity equals plus two accuracy five dexterity equals plus one evasion okay so what i need to do is get like strength and dexterity and then a little bit of intelligence so that i have mana I'm not really sure what all of this stuff is yet. Uh, I'm gonna TP to town. I think that's just what I'm supposed to do. Uh, okay. To tar, 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 tar log. Is this another player? Oh, I guess this is another player. Okay, she's a archer, I guess. Uh, she's looking pretty decent here, I guess. In terms of low-level characters, so she's level 14. So, as I thought, you do get better-looking stuff. Uh, is there a way to inspect her or something? Uh. Okay, if you right click you can, you can get a bunch of options. You can't I don't I guess you can't expect other people. You can't see what their gear is. Or maybe she just has the option turned off so that she's not letting you. Oh I can't go this way. Um what's this event notice board, okay. Uh what's this? Okay, that's just some bullshit. What is it? Is these other characters? Okay, so I guess those are just other characters. Uh, what's this? That's no one, I guess. Uh, what's that? Oh, 
I'm gonna put anything in here. There's a pretty large dash, but then again, everything is based off of like the size of the pits in your inventory. So what you did to Hillock out there, Shadow? Your murderous art is the reason you're here, in exile. And it'll be the one thing that sees you through to another dawn. I'm Nessa, and I suppose I should thank you for ridding us of the putrid giant. Back in Aurea, I feared your kind, condemned you from afar. In Rayclast, I don't have that luxury. Okay, so I can sell items here? So I guess I can just sell these... I can sell stuff like this. And then... What am I getting? A stack of five cards becomes a scroll of wisdom, and then what? Scroll of wisdom to let me see what items are. Uh, I probably won't be using a shield, I'll probably be dual building. Would that give me? A stack of 20 stars becomes an orb transmutation. Okay. And get rid of that. I have seven of them now. Okay. But anything I can purchase with? Uh, it doesn't look like it. Oh, I have to purchase with orbs or scrolls of wisdom or. Okay. That's interesting. Get a wand. Is there any, like, daggers or anything? I can increase my mana regenerate. That's interesting. I can increase my stat. Uh, so there's a few interesting things she sells. Um, Alright, but I'm gonna wrap it up here and uh, I will catch you guys later in the next episode. Um, I'm probably gonna. Uh, in the next episode, me, uh, Brian, and CB will probably be uh, meeting up here and we'll all get ready to go into our event. Is that dual wielding? What is that? What the fuck is that? Okay, sorry, I got distracted here, guys. Um, I'm probably gonna catch up later and uh, we'll, we'll all get into this game and see how it goes together. But uh, I'm probably gonna make a different character and uh, see what playing through other things is like, see if I start in a different grid, um, and just get some basic knowledge of the game, uh, but I'll do that all off screen, and then I'll come back when they're, uh, all with me, and we'll, we'll get into the gameplay of this, so, I'll catch you all later, I'm hoping that this will be a new game that I'll be playing in the meantime, in my downtime between League, Outlaws, Pokemon Mo, stuff like that, it just looks cool, um, I've always been a fan of Diablo, so this is just, you know, something I'm looking at, so. I'll catch you all later. Hope you all enjoyed. Heaven sent my residence is everyone just visiting, blending.